Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. Today's video is going to be, as we get closer to Christmas break here, um, I always have my students do an inventory right before Christmas break. Uh, it has a couple of uh, functions. Number one, um, as the year has gone since August, I can just walk by and tell people's kits, I mean, they're just messed up. Um, they take their pieces and they don't put them back in the right places. I see some of them, they just take their pieces and dump them at the bottom of their kit. Um, it's just a huge, gigantic mess. So the Christmas break gives us a great chance to just reset and get ready for the next semester. So, and another function would be, it just allows me to see that they have all their pieces. Because I've noticed as the months have gone on and on and on, uh, that my students go to the extra piece kits uh, cabinets more often and more often and more often because they're losing stuff. So it has two functions again, just to get them to organize their kit. And number two, so that they're going to the extra piece kits uh, less and less and wasting less time. So if you can see, what I did is I just took the map that comes with the LEGO EV3 Mindstorms kit and I basically blew it up to 11 by 17 here. And what I did is uh, made them two copies. This is what's below their kit, and this is what's in their tray. And what I basically have them do is cross off what they have. If they're missing something, they go get it. If they have too many things, they give them back to me for extra pieces until their kit is perfect to the 541 pieces that they're supposed to have. I actually um, make this a part of their grade. I do a check-in, and if they're off, then that definitely takes away from their grade. Um, and I also make them wipe their brick. <clears throat> if, I don't know about you guys, but I see my students going through program after program after program, can't find it because there's a million programs. Okay, literally not, maybe not a million, but they're scrolling through so many programs, so this also gives them a chance to clear their brick so when they also uh, check in their kit, they also show me that they've wiped every single program off. And then when we come back from Christmas break, we can start fresh and they can start, you know, putting things on their brick. So that's just how I do my Christmas break inventory. Let me go ahead and show you what that looks like in my classes. Okay, everybody, so hopefully this might be something that might be helpful for you, those of you that teach robotics, to just incorporate into your classrooms so that way um, things can just be organized. Uh, students are wasting less time looking for things because it's back in their kit, like it was hopefully at the beginning of the school year. So that's just another thing that I might do that hopefully helps you in your classrooms. I know a lot of you teach robotics and you're like, hey, what can we do to help our students and help our classes be a little bit more organized? So this is one of those things. Okay, guys, hopefully uh, you're still doing great. Um, have a great uh, beginning of your week. I am Mr. Hino from Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. I'm out. <laughs>